Two still. Alrighty, as you can probably tell, this customer had some water in the transmission. We talked about that earlier yesterday, I think. Okay, but if you notice, the spring has some white paint on it. The white paint was 100 PSI that they used, I don't know, well this is, goes back to the 80s, so. Alright, what we're going to do is we're going to stick in this black spring. The white spring on the test stand was only coming up with 100 PSI. Constant, not a problem, you know, it didn't reverse, neutral, forward, all stayed the same. So I knew we had a problem probably with the selective valve. But I really thought it was just, you know, stuck. You can actually see the little marks on it. Sometimes if you get water in it, the plunger will actually get kind of rusted in on the bottom and it won't give you the pressure you need. So we're going to put this together. So we take a little... A little gizmo here, bolt thingy I made, push it in there, pushes the cap down, and there's a snap ring on the top. That you pull it is a snap ring ring, and you pop it out, and out pops the whole contraption. Alrighty, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to call. We just had a customer, a gentleman from Oregon cruising down to Mexico from somewhere. <laughs> I don't know. Call me and stuff, and I gave him some advice, and he's going to buy a kit. Alrighty, and we'll catch you on the next video. Have a wonderful day. It's, I have no clue what day it is. Is it Tuesday? Ah, alright, sounds good. Take care, bye.